Welcome to Literacy. It is a marvelous, magnificent Monday. And today the task is going to be looking for books online. This is something I'm going to have you do most days. So I want you to take the time today to look around and see what is interesting to you. So you're going to do it through Learning Commons and you're going to go to Read and there is a link in the announcement section. If you're not sure how to do it and you need to go through all of the steps, there's a document that will show you how to do it. So once you get to the Read part, there are three ways of doing it. One, which is called Storyline Online and I am going to demonstrate what that looks like. So you're going to take a video and it's going to be a person who's going to have a book like this which says, come over to my house. This is one of my favorites. Don't worry, I'm not going to read the whole thing, but I want you to have an idea. Come over to my house. Come over to my house. Some houses are bricks and some houses are sticks. Some houses are square, some houses are round. There are all kinds of houses around to be found. Some are on stilts, high off of the ground. Some houses are wide, some houses are thin. Some are so thin, you can hardly get in. But wherever you go, you will hear somebody say, come over to my house, come over and play. So you are welcome into my house. And so the other two types that you've had is the type two is tumble books, and most of you know it. And the third type is called teen book cloud, which has a little bit more um, chapter type books in there. So what I would like you to do is to choose maybe one kind or you can choose multiple kinds. Take a look and see the types of books that are there. There's nothing wrong with wanting to look at picture books. I love going into tumble books and having it read to me. I also like having other people read to me. And one little part about the story online, storyline online is they actually have longer books. So the first one that I clicked into was actually 20 minutes. So that would definitely cover your 15 minutes. Now, to know that you are actually doing what I'm asking you to do, there's a question set up on Google Classroom, and I want you to either cut and paste and bring it over, or you can actually type and give me the name. So the name and who wrote it or the author. That's what I'm looking for today. I hope everybody has a really awesome day. I miss you all, and I hope you like my reading hat. I'm going to have some different hats that are going to come along, but today this was the reading hat. Have a super awesome day, and we'll see you tomorrow. Bye.